All right, everyone, welcome to the pizza topping tier list. You sure can tell a lot about a person based on which toppings they like, especially those chicken Alfredo people, a bunch of sickos. What the hell is up with some of these toppings, Barack? A fucking hamburger? Hey, don't talk to Barack like that. You look like the fucking ulti medium cheeseburger from regular show. I'll take that as a compliment. That shit looks dummy thick. Can you both shut the hell up for a second? I need to finish this tier list before Michelle gets home. I've got Taco Bell wrappers and balled up tissues everywhere that I need to clean up. Uh, yeah. We helped you make that mess. Man, that room smelled good. All right, first on the list is anchovies. Is it just me or has anyone here even tried pizza with anchovies? The only time I tasted the saltiness of an anchovy was when Jill was supposed to give me my suppository for my hemorrhoids. She pranked me and slipped an anchovy up my ass, stung like hell from the salt. It's a D tier for me. I've never tried anchovies myself, but based on that story, I want to puke just thinking about them. You're right. This is going straight to D tier. Okay, next is bacon, something we should all be familiar with. I mean, who isn't a fan of it? I built this entire country on bacon. Bacon is superior to all other pizza toppings. It is S tier. You practically reek of bacon grease, Donald. That is not surprising coming from you. That's just my natural musk. Hate to say it, Don, but I agree with Joe there. Anyway, that is not to say that you are far off. Bacon and cheese are a good pair, but it's not the best. That reminds me of the bacon, egg, and cheese sandwiches my mother used to make me in the mornings while I would watch the magic school bus. I was 69 back then. A tier for me. A tier it is. You assholes. Okay, next is barbecue chicken. I might have had this on a pizza once at a hole-in-wall restaurant. Can't say I was all that impressed. Why the hell is barbecue chicken even on this list? That shit deserves to be eaten on the bone next to a heaping mound of mashed potatoes and gravy, which is the best appetizer I might add. Mashed potatoes and gravy isn't an appetizer, Don. Sometimes I like sticking my fingers into the mashed potatoes. It's so warm and gooey, really turns me on. You sick fuck. Hand that shit over so I can devour it properly. I'm starving over here. All right, you two, we are getting off topic. Barbecue chicken is good by itself, like you said, but as a pizza topping, it's not that great. The small pieces make the chicken dry out too easily from the steam, and it turns rubbery. Still a decent flavor, though. It's gonna go in C tier. Okay, now we have bell peppers. Not a bad choice, honestly. I would agree with you, Barack, but the only reason why someone like you would say that is because of those goaded supreme pizzas that have peppers on them. Those peppers would be nothing without the pepperoni and sausage. Shut the fuck up, Donald. Those peppers play as much of a role as the meat does. Peppers are bitter and meat is umami. You can't compare them. Only a saggy ass schmeat like yourself would eat that rabbit food, Sleepy Joe. Sea tire at best. Maybe Don is on to something here. By itself, it doesn't appear that great, especially when the steam wilts the peppers and they turn into a used condom. It's going in C tier only because of the supreme pizza. Okay, Canadian bacon. Just looks like ham to me, to be honest. You lowlifes don't know a thing about meat. Canadian bacon comes from the pig's back and ham comes from its legs. If you're a back guy like myself, you're drooling over this stuff. If it was American bacon, I would put it in S tier. It's a tier for me. I'm more of a feet guy, actually. Why isn't pig's feet on here? Because they're in your wife's shoes. No, they're not. I just sniffed them the other day. Holy shit, you two cannot stay focused. I will just put Canadian bacon and ham in A tier. Same difference, honestly, and they taste great on pizza. Okay, so now we have corn. Who the hell made this tier list? No one in their right mind would ever put that shit on a pizza and say yummy. Growing up on the farm, we would grow corn. We would shuck it, then fuck it. That's how we made cream corn. Joe, next time I see you, I'm taking your gonads and shoving them up your ass. Oh boy, yeah. What the fuck? You guys are weird. It's going in D tier because that is just simply immoral. Next on the list is hamburger. I've put some thought into it, and I believe this is referring to ground beef. The cheese pizza with beef creates a cheeseburger flavor. Well, in that case, put some mustard and ketchup on that shit, and I will be in hog heaven. One more greasy meal like that, and you might end up there. Shut the hell up, Sleepy Joe, before I rub my greasy nuts all over your Xbox controller. To be honest, I do not believe plain ground beef would provide any flavor to the pizza, which is kind of why they tend to add sauces and such to enhance the flavor of a burger. So with that, it could be good, but alone, it's C tier at best for me. What the hell was that noise? Oh shit, Michelle is home. You two jerk offs wouldn't stop fucking around. I gotta go. It's okay. We can finish it later. It's time for my afternoon nap. Yeah, I'm starving later, nerds.